Hey y'all, this is Super Testnet, and today I wanted to show you my latest invention, which is Superstore, uh, a simple web store for Noster. I created this project because uh, I've often wanted to start a store, but it's always so difficult. You gotta like install software, you gotta sometimes purchase a server, you gotta get, get the pay fees to Wix or PayPal or whoever you're using as a payment method. And it's, it's always just a hassle to set up a store. So I wanted something that's super simple um, to do. And that's what I came up with. So with this one, when you go to this, the website, which right now is just on my GitHub, uh, I'll put the link under the video, but you know, pretty soon I hope to get a URL for this. When you go to the, um, when you go to the website, this is the first thing you see. And it's like, whoa, I just start adding products immediately. Yeah, you do. So I'm going to sell, to show an example, I'm going to sell a picture of a duck, uh, which of course you can get online for free if you don't want to pay. A uh, picture of a duck, not... Uh, not a real duck. Uh, let's set a shipping zone of uh, free and digital because uh, there's no reason to actually, you know, send it somewhere serious. You can do a product preview and see what your uh, product will look like once it's on the store. You can add additional products if you want. You can, like, here I just click to add one. Let's, you know, I could add more if I wanted, but I only want one item in this particular store. So let's hit submit. It creates a Noster event for each of your items. And then a Noster event for your store. And let's view the store, see what that looks like. So here is the store, this is what people see. And there's also a management link, uh, which you can click. And this shows uh, a page where you can like add, add products again. You can also manage sales and withdraw your money if you, if you have any, there's a little wallet right here where you can withdraw your money. Uh, but let's see what it looks like if someone wants to, wants to buy a duck. So they can view the product and they can be like, oh yeah, that looks like a nice duck. It's got a nice description and that's a shipping info. Add it to my cart, updates your little cart icon right there. Uh, let's buy two of them. I want to buy two of this duck. If you didn't want, if you've messed up or something, you can just delete one of your items right there. But I actually want both ducks, so I'll make two. Uh, it gives you a little total. It says this is how much you've got to pay. And then it gives you instructions, since this is a digital good, it wants to know how, how I should deliver it to you. Uh, send it to my Telegram. Um, tester uh, of Telegram. Yeah, that's a good thing. Hit checkout. And this Bitcoin address is generated from your Nostra private key using my Whisper addresses protocol that I made a long time ago, which is kind of like stealth addresses. Uh, every time the user comes here, it'll be a different, um, it'll be a different pub, uh, uh, Bitcoin address but you'll always have the, um, it'll always be derived from your Nostra private key. So that's kind of cool. Uh, let's see, I'm supposed to send that amount. Okay, so I just got out my phone and scanned the QR code and now I'm gonna pay with a three sat per byte transaction fee. So let me hit okay and send the payment. Uh, all right, so I just sent a payment. Uh, it is showing up, it should show up in the mempool any second. And when it does, uh, when this, pay, this page is checking the mempool to see when the payment arrives. And as soon as it detects it, it should show us uh, a receipt. Uh, and yep, there it is. We got a receipt saying, you know, here's your here's your receipt. You purchased two ducks. The total was 50 cents and it gives us a little proof of payment. Uh, and yeah, that's pretty cool. If we head back over here to the um, to the store management thing, we can see we have one new sale uh, of our duck. And if we take a look, we can see, oh, now we have we have 50 cents in our Bitcoin wallet, which we can withdraw at any time. Because uh, this is self-custodial, there I'm not the the website does not have custody of your funds, and neither do I. Uh, well, I mean I do in this case because I'm because I'm the one who owns this wallet. But uh, this is all just derived from your Nostra private key, uh, which it creates for you when you up when you uh, your browser creates one for you when you load the page. So I can actually see that they did pay for the ducks, and I can you know send send the pictures of the duck to this Telegram address, and then mark it as shipped. And when I do that, I can withdraw uh, the, the sats, which, uh, which I can just put in a Bitcoin address here where I want them to go. So let me do that. Okay, so I just put up a, got a Bitcoin address from my Bitcoin wallet. I'm going to send the funds to there. Uh, please enter a fee rate, and I will do three sats per byte. So then it asks me if this is what I want. Send 1,046 sats with a 750 sat mining fee. And uh, there's not going to be anything left over in this address when I'm done. So yeah, that looks all good. So I will hit OK. And that was a success. I can even go to mempool.space and view my uh, transaction. There it is. 
Uh, yeah, so I just withdrew the money. And as soon as that, um, yeah, now it updates and says I no longer have any money in my address. But yeah, this is a quick and simple way to create a web store uh, and create products and manage your, manage your web store and get started with selling stuff for Bitcoin very easily uh, using the power of Noster. Um, yeah, hope you like it and enjoy.